So for our fat testing, we will add uh, 1.5 ml of ammonium. This is the Bajani method. I'm just gonna add three drops of phenethylene. It helps with um, showing the separation of the phases. So we have, there's three extractions evolved. This is extraction number one. When I, like I said, I've already added 1.5 of ammonium to my sample. Now I'm gonna add 10 mils of ethanol. Again, make sure you've got your safety glasses on and we're working on a fume hood and we have gloves on and we gently rock that over and back. And then the next sample we add is diethyl ether. So we want to add 25 mils of diethyl ether uh, to our sample. So we're just letting that settle. about enough there. So we'll let it again gently rock it over and back. Just let it stand there for a minute. So the next one then we'll be doing is our skim. Now our skim is our control because there should be no fat coming through in our skim. And the last uh, chemical I, I add for the first extraction is the petroleum uh, spirit. Okay, so we add in 25 mils of that. and we'll rock gently uh, mix it by rocking it over and back and we will allow it to stand for 30 minutes so after the uh, first extraction we're going to decant um, all the ethanol from the majani into our evaporating our pre-weighed evaporating ditch Just release the cork and slowly add it in. So left behind should be some of the protein. We're only taking in the ethanol here. Okay, so that's our first sample. And then we leave it on the um, evaporating uh, dish to let it evaporate when we're doing the second extraction. this one you can see there from this we're getting very very little ethanol because that's the skim milk that's our control This is our light milk. So we'll leave them on the evaporating uh, dish here. You can see they're bubbling away. So all the ethanol is evaporating off and hopefully we'll get down to our fat. So that's the first extraction. Now we're gonna work on the second extraction, but the second extraction, we're only adding an ethanol reduced quantity, only 10 mils, diethyl ether and uh, petroleum spirit. 
we can see uh, the fat samples coming through here all right so we're on our last extraction now and in this one we this is our third extraction so again we'll add the contents leave it sitting for 30 minutes leave our samples here on the evaporating dish and you can already see um, the fat coming through the nice yellow on the fat coming through there okay so after our third extraction uh, if we're looking at our samples here, we can see that we've got uh, a whole, our whole milk sample, our light sample, and you can see our skin milk sample. There's, there's nothing coming through in that, and that was our control sample. So we're going to take these samples now, and we're going to put them into the 100 degree incubator, or oven really. Remember when you open the oven, just let it stand back, let the heat come out. And they go in there for about an hour just to let the last bits of moisture dry out so we're left just with fat i'll also put in the skim milk sample just as the control we'll close that over And we'll have that now uh, in there for about one hour. So once the hour is up, remove the evaporating dishes from the oven. Bring them over to the analytical uh, balance. Uh, the one that you used in the beginning. Weigh your, uh, weigh your evaporating dishes, record your results and work on your calculations.